Hello, I'm Rebecca Russell, Patient Education Specialist with PMD Healthcare. Welcome to How to Complete Your Spirometry Test with SpiroPD. This is what SpiroPD looks like. Notice the on-off button at the top left, the USB connector port at the top right, and the indicator lights across the bottom. When you first get your SpiroPD, you'll be asked to enter your personal information into the device. You'll be guided through entering all of your basic demographics. The initial settings can be changed at any time through the settings menu. And once a year, SpiroPD will wish you a happy birthday and will ask you if you'd like to update your personal settings. Here's the home screen. The home screen gives you quick and easy access to all functions available on the SpiroPD. Across the top, you have your upload data button, your time and date, and your battery display. The middle section encompasses the run test, view trends, manage meds, and set alarms keys. The bottom, you have your left and right scroll buttons to view completed past events or events which will be taking place in the future. Running a test. In preparation for your test, make sure your personal profile has already been set. Decide whether sitting or standing is more comfortable for you and remain consistent with that position. You don't want to test in a windy area or near a fan. You want to keep your airway as open as you possibly can throughout the entire test. So make sure to sit or stand up nice and straight and tall. Keep two hands on the soft squeezable handles and your arms out to expand your rib cage. Then from the home screen, you're simply going to tap run test. You'll turn SpiroPD around so the screen is facing away from you, and you're going to wait until you hear the audible instructions. Once you hear the audible coach say, take a deep breath, go ahead and do so away from the mouthpiece. You don't want to inhale through SpiroPD. Once you hear SpiroPD say, exhale now, place your mouth on the mouthpiece and exhale or breathe out as quickly forcibly and completely as you possibly can. As you're breathing out, you will see little blue motivational LED lights lighting up. Now there's seven of these, and the goal is to light all seven of them. You're gonna continue exhaling until you hear good effort or until you simply cannot breathe out any longer. If you need to inhale again just to catch your breath, simply take your mouth off of the Spiro PD, take it off of the mouthpiece, and turn your head to the side to breathe. Make sure that you keep SpiroPD still the entire time. Now, let me show you what it looks like to take a successful test. Spirometry tests are effort dependent. Here are some tips to help you avoid retaking the test. Never inhale through SpiroPD. It measures your exhalation only. Make sure to wait for the audible instructions which say exhale now before exhaling. You don't want to exhale too early. Try and empty your lungs as fast as you possibly can. And make sure to keep the SpiroPD still the entire time. If you need help, we're here. Be sure to see your user manual or contact us at any time for more information on managing medications, viewing trends, or uploading reports. Thank you.